What's up, everyone? Uh, I've seen people on YouTube do different videos like the unboxing of this or the opening of that. And so I figured I would do something different than my usual vlogs on wrestling or whatever the subject is. And I just recently got a box of the 2014 Topps WWE Chrome cards. So figured I'd open them and let you see what I got. And um, depending on the response of this video, we'll determine whether I do more of these or not. I already got the plastic off of it. So let's see what we got. We got, it says seven packs plus four X Factor cards. Ooh, X Factor. Oh, here's the X Factor ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like they're all here. All right. Well, let's start opening them up and see what we got here. Eh? Right. First package. Um, oh, all right. Well, these look pretty slick. We got Undertaker. With a big leg drop move. Pretty badass. We got DDP, Diamond Dallas Page. It looks like each card has, um, you know, stuff on the back, you know, something a little bit about their history or whatever. And we got Legend Mick Foley. All right. And last but not least for that package, it says the Iron Sheik. This looks like a, a painting of some sort. Oh, oh, this says Champion Portraits by Jerry the King Lawler. Oh, I didn't know he did paintings. One of ten. Huh, well, that's interesting card of the painting done by Jerry Lawler, the Iron Sheik. Pretty cool. All right. Four cards in each. All right. <laughs> Obviously has changed since I used to collect cards when I was a wee little nerd. <laughs> All right. Next pack. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Old Daniel Bryan. Next, wow. we go Bray Wyatt. Awesome. Oh no, this is oh this is different. Oh, that's only two cards, but this last one says authentic shirt relic. Dolph Ziggler, and it actually has a part of his blue shirt in the card, but there was only three in that package. Oh, well, it's pretty cool. You know, got a part of Dolph Ziggler's shirt. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's right, women, be jealous. That's right. <laughs> really? Yeah. I went there. That's right. All right, next pack, we got, oh, and the hits just keep on coming. This one has four in it. All right. Roman Reigns. Nice. <laughs> yeah, all right. This must be the, must be the announcer pack. All right. Uh, Michael Cole on the commentary pack. You'll see why in a second. Jerry, the King Lawler. Ooh, these are shiny. Wow. And last but not least, my God! Good old JR. <laughs> Pretty cool. All so, so far, I'm impressed. These are pretty cool. I opened up one the other day that I got from the dollar store. It was like last year's 2013 cards. And I got half the ones in the cards were like people not even with the company anymore. 
Um, speaking of people that aren't with the company anymore, well, not this one. This one is. This is pretty cool. NXT's Xavier Woods. You see that? And then this is what I was talking about. People not with the company anymore, but um, Legends, nonetheless, pretty cool. Uh, Legend Junk Yard Dog, JYD. Oh, wow. Larry, oops, Larry Zabisco. Larry Zabisco. And Bob Backlund. Pretty cool. And let me know in the comments below if you guys collect these. Um, yeah, I pick these up once in a while, you know, just because I'm a big wrestling fan. Um, I don't put these in a book or anything. I should, though. Um, not going to show my whole collection. Eh, maybe I will sometime in, in a video. I'll show my whole collection of cards. Uh, some are cool. Some are eh, you know. Um, okay, this package. Let's see here. This one's different. Wins the WWE Tag Team Championship with Rey Mysterio. Batista. That's kind of a unique card. Little little time piece there. Ooh, the Viper. Randy Orton. And Layla. Yeah, stop that. All right. Uh, oh, and Darren Young. All right. Okay, package. That's nice. You know, got a little variety. No doubles yet. That's pretty cool. You know, that's kind of sucks when you get things like this. You end up with a bunch of doubles. So, no doubles. Or did I speak too soon? We'll find out. We got three packages left. Let's see what we got. All right. First, we got We the People, Jack Swagger. <laughs> nice. Curtis Axel. Uh, fired GM of oh this says superstar rookie card well that's interesting Brad Maddox and he's already been fired <laughs> uh, now he's doing YouTube videos where he was stuck in a cave or something go check that out look, look them up they're kind of funny uh, and last but not least for this package Titus O'Neil uh, hurrah, hurrah, hurrah. Can't do it. Whatever. All right. Last regular package, and then we got the bonus cards to look at. So so far, pretty cool. Not bad. <laughs> nice. A Wisconsin favorite. Hornswoggle. Yes. The man, the myth, the legend from Wisconsin. Hornswoggle. Pretty sweet. Maybe if I see him around here sometime soon, I'll have to get it signed. He shows up at local wrestling events every once in a while. Um, Ryback. So that's cool. Got the tag team of Ryback and Curtis Axel. Oh, former Funkadactyl, Naomi. Oh, this is cool. NXT card. He just got back from injury. This is a slightly older look of his, but very cool nonetheless. Enzo Amore. And if you don't like him, you are S-A-W-F-T soft. Nice. Love NXT. Very good show. If you haven't watched NXT, go check it out. Seriously. It's the uh, developmental 
section of the WWE. Very entertaining to watch. It's all the up-and-coming superstars. Now, last but not least in this package is the four bonus cards. We have... Wow, these are really shiny. All right. Jay Uso. Ooh, psychedelic looking. <laughs> And Damian Sandow, looking certainly better than he did last night in his retired Floridian gear. <laughs> uh, oh, rookie card, WWE Bo Dallas. Do you believe? All right. <laughs> And last but not least, formerly let go, not with the company anymore, the B.C. Brodus Clay. So, that is our package. Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. I'm actually a little surprised we didn't get a John Cena out of there. Um, but nonetheless, good collection. Uh, let me know if you collect or... Uh, you know, whatever. Might get another one of these sometime soon. It's, uh, I got this from Target. These are 20 bucks or $19.99. Uh, pretty cool. Yeah, I pick these up once in a while. It's a pretty good deal. It's not like it used to be back in the day where you get a ton of cards and, uh, you know, in one package so yeah they've gone up over the years but nonetheless you know if you're a wrestling fan it's kind of cool you know i don't watch baseball so i don't collect uh baseball cards but i watch wrestling so we collect wrestling cards so all right there's your stack there's the bunch 20 bucks pretty decent collection thanks for watching guys